Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 24 in chapter 15. Chapter 15 is about waves. In this one, the wave equation is given. It is about x and t. Now we need to find these quantities like wavelength, frequency, velocity, amplitude, and speed. So now from this quantity, or from this equation, we can write the quantity like the amplitude, angular velocity, and wave number there. Do you agree? Yes. And then we can also check our test book, write the equations for the relative to these quantities, omega, wave number, and velocity there. Right? Now, first one, we need to find the wavelength. So for wavelength, the most easy one is to use this equation. We can say k is given, 2 pi is a constant. So lambda is 2 pi over k, and then you get the answer there. The next one, you need to find a frequency. So we use this function, right? Omega is 2 pi f. So frequency is omega over 2 pi. You get the answer there. Next one, you need to find the uh, velocity. So this one. We know velocity is wavelength divided by period. So period is 1. 1 over period is a frequency. So this one, you get the answer there. Next one, amplitude is exactly there. And then next one for the maximum and the minimum speed. So this is from previous chapters, is a simple harmonic oscillations. We know maximum speed is omega times a. The minimum speed is zero. Thank you.